I think the point I'm trying to make is that in, in, in sports, you do have female sports icons. Sanya Mirza, Saina Nehwal, PT Usha, they have been sports it's icons. It's and beginning. That's, that, that's, that's, no, it's beginning, it's but important. what Sonam Singh is, has a point, that we need to pay more attention on sports per se, as, it, as, as, yeah. as, as a focus of attention. Yeah. 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 I mean, I even though in, in when we chose the sports uh, categories, uh, Sonam, must share with you, that they're unusual fields. Yeah. One is a cyclist, a cyclist. one is a football player, one is a, a referee, yes, uh, so th you know, therefore yeah. to have this entire character, and one is of course uh, having a, a serious yeah. disability who went into para-athlete uh, Deepa Malik. So you're, you're having a totally different dimension because you know, b before bend it like Beckham, uh, f uh, football wasn't exactly as popular as it was in, in India. Right. So you have developed certain yeah. things so across the way. This was the most difficult category for us to Yeah, do. it's, yeah. it's yeah. very yeah. sad. It's very, very sad and I... Like I said, we, we are a lot of people and <laughs> we have all kinds of people. I'm just, I don't understand. I'm sure that there are lots of talented athletes out there that are not getting the chance and the opportunity to be, because sports requires a lot of money to excel in the field of sports. Mm. And my request is uh, people who are giving away money for good deeds, I think you all should invest in sports because honestly being a sportsman or a sportswoman, encourages yeah. a lot of uh, good qualities in human beings. Right. You know, mm -hmm. uh, sportsmanship so, and com comp co healthy competition. Yes, Absolutely. Yeah. But so yeah. the, the film world is also doing a bit about it. Bhag Milka Bhag, etc. Yeah, yeah. You know, you actually other, developing... Other sports-based films uh, yeah. which are now starting to come. Mary Com, you know, yeah. and, and films like that. Just wanted to, you know, I tell all members of the jury, I think one of the things that's really great, and I guess this is part of what you were trying to do, is also nominate and honor people who aren't necessarily that well known exactly. because otherwise when you have sports and you have entrepreneurship you know yeah. it's, you'd it's say not the usual names Sanya yeah. Mirza, Sanya yeah. Nehwal yeah. and, yeah. and there you are in yeah. Mary Com. They are like incredible achievers as well they so are, it's also important I'm, to recognize that. Yeah. But I think it's great Sonam that they are they're Unsung. different people who are yes. coming up in entrepreneurship. Unsung hero is always yeah. great. Yeah. Was that deliberate? Manchu? Yes, that is yeah. deliberate and uh, we've been trying to do it uh, over the last uh, five years. So every year we scout for, uh, you know, one fresh talent and two people who are not that recognized and three, of course, people, uh, some people who are much younger because uh, when you uh, get encouraged early, I think, uh, you know, you can go a long way with that. So. And I think a brilliant example is, is under entrepreneurship. We've got on one hand, yeah. Vali, who's in the you know, multi-million dollar uh, investment business. And then we've got uh, uh, Rabi Devi, yeah. Yeah. who is, who is you know, right down in the village level. It's wonderful. So, Sonam, now people have to start voting, right? Yes. That's another tough... <laughs> Guys, please, please vote um, online. Is it only online right yes, now? It's online. online. So, vote online. My request is that you go in Mahilao ki ke liye vote ki jiye. Please vote. Uh, it's very, very, very important because these women need encouragement. They are only improving our society and they're only improving our quality of life. So please do that. Thank you. All right. So that voting is going to be up next. But Swaram, there's something we want you to unveil on that oh. corner of the... I love this part. Speech. Awards? It's yeah, exciting. This is what the award looks like. So come. Uh, Jory, we can just stay on. We'll just get the award back and maybe have a, have a photo up. But let's just...
Thank you so much for watching. We'll keep the photographs going and take questions now as well. But for all of you watching us on TV in particular, thank you so much. Remember, those voting platforms are going to be open very soon. So do get on there and vote to find the winners in this. And it's going to be a really, really tough choice. So ndtv.com slash women of birth. Do log on there. You can also vote on the app, Facebook, all sorts of places. Do log on. Bye. All right. We can now take some questions. Can we just sit down for two more minutes? Yeah. Was it was a horse only on television? Like. What do you think? What do you think? I'm just waiting for that question to be asked by somebody. She lives in Delhi. Very fair. Very good shape. All right. Um, any questions? Yeah, the gentleman there. Yeah. Well, good afternoon, everyone. Uh, so, firstly, I would like to congratulate all the dignitaries uh, for coming up with such a great initiative, uh, which you are calling a philanthropic uh, initiative, which is called uh, Women of Worth. So, I've got uh, two questions I think uh, should ask with Sonam first. Uh, Sonam, since uh, this event is related to women, uh, and India is an emerging country in the world, uh, a few emerged, days back, darling, it's emerged. Yeah, yeah, sorry, it's <laughs> emerged. Okay. So a few days back, there uh, an incident took place in Bangalore. Yes. A Tanzanian woman yes, was, was beaten. Uh, she, yeah, she was uh, stripped and she was uh, uh, beaten and she was uh, um, uh, walked naked on the road. So Mr. Arna Goswami, he says that this incident proves that India is uh, getting racist and uh, intolerant country. What What do you like to say on this? What would I like to say? Um, I think uh, racism exists all over the world. I don't think it's specific to India, but the reason education has always been my favorite uh, category is because education and literacy is something that makes people aware and less ignorant and uh, makes people make decisions which are a little more thoughtful as opposed to uh, behaving like hooligans and people with no... Uh, and, and, you know, behaving jungly, I think, if I, I might use this very crude word. Uh, she takes offense to Germany. Okay, sorry, it's a very crude word, I shouldn't say, but very, it's a, it's, a, it's a colloquial term that we use, but it was a very badly done thing, but I'm, I do not think it's specific to India. Yep. Racism and intolerance is not specific to India. It's, uh, it's something that is uh, across the globe. Yep. So I don't think we should uh, kind of say that it's only Indians who are like that. I've faced racism in the world all over, so it's fine. All right, somebody else? Uh, hi, Manshi, my question is to you. So this is the fifth edition of Women of Word this year. So how is it different this year or bigger? What are your plans? How, how do you make so, it different? Uh, two things. I think that uh, uh, this time uh, we've, uh, we've actually changed the process a little bit. So uh, we uh, selected the nominees today. And this time all the nominees go on for public voting. So uh, in the previous years, we've had only certain categories restricted to public voting. But this year, uh, people are going to vote for all categories online. So that's a difference. Uh, but I think uh, the most important difference is the fact that we've tied up uh, also with uh, NDTV. And we think that NDTV is going to be a conduit to make this uh, whole initiative and property uh, larger and reach out to more people. So we hope to, in partnership, inspire many more people to do this kind of work. Sonam, I have a question for you. Yes. Can you relate Nirja as woman of worth? And if yes, then how? Nirja. <laughs> uh, well, yes. She was an ordinary girl who did something extraordinary because she decided that she wanted to do her duty. Uh, she's the youngest recipient of the Ashok Chakra. And uh, she was a woman of worth. Unfortunately, at the age of, before she could turn 23, two days before she could turn 23, she sacrificed her life uh, in uh, trying to help other people. Yes, so she most definitely was a woman of worth. For more news and gossip, don't forget to subscribe to Bollywood Helpline.